it just messes up a lot. That and the forward smash, forward smash, forward smash. That which is not not good. Yeah, like yeah. If I'm playing like fast, like against against Ben Z fast, that's not that's not happening. You know. Well, yeah, because um, if you're just overwhelming it, there's no chance to even throw it out. Yeah. That is really a secret nerf, though, is, like, when you play someone that you know you can beat... It, it gets you, in your head. Yeah, it's not even so much that. It's not like, oh, I can beat him, but he's beating me. It's not even about that. It's about my just hands go slow, and you just... It becomes it's a lot like automated, just, more Yeah, less. it's like you don't try, and he definitely... Listen, if he beat me, oh, I should have tried. Like, that... He deserved. Yeah, he, he deserved more than what I gave him. Mm. So I'm kind of a I'm kind of a dick bag all around there. McNabb and Jason. Uh, uh, who who are we? Fi oh, this is round three, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, I should have two setups. Though, is this winners round three? Uh, this is winners round three. Yeah. Right. I'm gonna start calling losers actually. Yeah. Um, and then update this as well. This is who? Where's uh, who? Scoop Dish and <laughs> JP. And yeah, who's on the left and who's on the right? Scoop Dish is on the left. Okay. Tilt the camera to the right a little bit. That's open. Why do we only have. I thought we had two setups. We do, don't we? So it's, are you guys warming up? I have. Scoop, can you do me a favor? Can you tilt the camera towards the center of you two? They're playing, they're playing. Towards the center of you two. Oh, you're are, are they? Are they? I asked them. Yeah, much better. So are they hand warming? That's what I thought. Maybe. That's open. Yeah, um. That's corner. Oh, maybe we didn't this. list that document. Yeah, switch sw switch this it. and this. Yeah, okay. Darian Adam! Oh, shit. <laughs> didn't even know. And then just hit up. Right there. And then we also need to switch these as well. Yeah. So. I got it. You got it? Oh, they're, 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 get, they're playing. Uh, so we actually are in. We, we're actually going into this here. So we have Scoop Dish versus JP. JP, the Pikachu Scoop Dish, the Sheik. Um, these two are actually pretty damn good, respectively. Yeah. Uh, Scoop Dish has some inconsistency problems, but when he's on, he's he's insane. Yeah. I actually faced him last one. Uh, we did uh, Pikachu Falco. I don't know if we did friendlies or if we played in tournament though. I don't quite remember. The Sheik usually wins this matchup, right? Um, yes, heavily. That's mid-tier blues. Does she have a chain grab on him, or is it, is it tech chase? It is, um, a little bit of tech chase, a little bit of chain grab, a little bit of everything. Um, combos Pikachu really hard. Oh, I messed it up. It's all good, we got it. Oh, Scoop Dish and JP are switched? Yeah. Oh, wait, shoot. Who's uh, the Pikachu? Max, or Scoopish. Okay. So it's this. So swap the so players again. It's weird because he's on my side. Yeah, I know. They should have They should have done something different. Swap the players. Then I swap the characters. Though. And swap the characters. Here, you can swap the characters. Anyway, let me get to commentating this match. A quick grab from uh, from JP. Just only does a back throw, though. But he gets a down tilt to fair, which will take Scoop Dish's stock. JP only went, um, still at four stocks, but at 117. Uh, I believe there's like a down throw to up air on Sheik, I believe. Or really, there's so many options that Pikachu has. A good hard hitting there, just like that, to grab ledge. All he has to do is roll up now. It uh, doesn't roll up, but elects for the regular get up, but still covers it with an F tilt. Was that an F tilt? It looked like a. It was an F tilt. <laughs> So, JP, some pretty decent platform movement, not gonna lie. Uh, Pikachu just has trouble getting in because she, she has a lot of um, residual hitboxes that just stay there. Like yeah, there whereas she has some matchups where she wants to get on in the characters, and this one she really just wants to she just wants to keep out Pikachu. Uh, Pikachu's gonna try to like cross up Sheik and yeah, um, cross up Nair to down smash, that's a very popular option. Because aren't you like, you try to nair, nair past them, right? Nair through them? Yeah, nair through them and then into down smash. Um, JP's, like, you'll see probably wave dash back four tilts. Uh, he's been dashing back. He got caught earlier, but, um, you know, the attentions were good. Uh, he probably wanted to drop through platform nair there, possibly. That's a good fair. Or needle, I said. It's a good up air to uh, cover the recovery. JP on top of this. This is very good. It's a hard, hard matchup for Pikachu. Because it's like, what do you do, you know? Yeah, because she does invalidate many, uh, like, lower tier characters. Mm -hmm. um, on defense, 
Scoop Dish is not going to want to do that. Yeah. It's not going to want SD. It's not SD anymore. Um, that was well played by JP. It was. JP like really had a firm handle on that. Um, scoop Dish. What do you think his counter pick would be? Probably something with a lower ceiling. Yoshi's uh, somewhere you can get in better. I'm, I'm thinking Yoshi's if it's not banned in PK Stadium. There we go. Right to Yoshi's. Hey, look at that. I'm actually a decent person at this game. <laughs> So, she does still have the platforms, though. Yeah, but at the same time, Pikachu can uh, platform tech chase with many different options. Yeah. Pikachu can use that really powerful up smash to kill Sheik off the top. Doesn't he have the... It's the... Uh, uh, most powerful best. uncharged. Yeah, uncharged. Yeah, fully... I think it's fully charged as well, but the point... Um, the difference between Fox, the discrepancy between those two, is that Fox's knockback growth is better. Trying to jab to that. Pikachu does, doesn't Pikachu have one of those small shields in the game? Pikachu, yeah, Pikachu shields is pretty sad. Ooh, the down throw to up smash. Not gonna kill. Would have elected for just you know. Well, that was that was a good there. I don't yeah. know why he grabbed after. Uh, tried to shield after that. Oh, good grab. Oh, Randall coming to the rescue this time. JP gets ledge back for free. Gets hit by a down tilt. Still gets ledge for free. Uh, Scoop has got to react a little bit harder on these. Beautiful. Oh, there you go. Good. I didn't think that up smash was going to connect to the platform. You know, it surprisingly does, but he got a, he got like a pretty weak hit because of like he just barely nicked it. Yeah. Uh, that thunder covered it, secured uh, the kill. Oh, I thought he air dodged for a second. If he did, I would have been heartbroken. I hate seeing I hate seeing good matches like this just go out. Just get ruined. Yeah. Okay, there. Do your T.O. thing, Tygo. Hang on. Loser seems messed up. Fine. Did someone do something bad with the ranking? That was a good back air. Yeah, very good coverage from JP. I'm surprised I didn't see any sort of, like, missile or up B. But, like I said, JP's right on top of it. Try to up air through the platforms. Up air. The up air, objectively, in my opinion, the worst move in the game for two reasons. It's so good because of the semi-spike hitbox, but it's so it's, bad because every single one is... Yeah. No, it's literally 3%. That's true. What's up? Oh, no. It's my least favorite move in the game because I'll play Falcon, and I'll get up here juggled for 30%, but it'll take about 30 seconds. Mm -hmm. JP just trying to keep this pressure on Scoop Dish. He's trying to go for those up-air chains. Yeah, before. JP really wants to fish for more grabs. I haven't seen him do too much off the grab. That's true. I think he's more of just uh, a neutral sheet rather than a tech chase type. Of yeah. Well, not even so much tech chase, but down throw to, you know, four yeah, air yeah, fair, yeah. the bread and butters. Uh, and here's another thing, is that with you have the grab advantage of Sheik. Yeah. Sheik has a fairly sizable grab range, while Peek's very negligible. Yeah, Pikachu is fucking T-Rex arms. Oh. I don't know what he was trying yeah. to do. But um, hopefully on the defensive side, Scoop Dish knows about his tech in place, that it's only two frames, I believe, instead yeah, of the standard one four. Of the, one of the best ones. It is the best one, right? It's, it's like the, the fastest. I think there's two. I think it's like Pikachu and Pichu. Just an extremely fast tech in place. That might be able to get him back into this game if he starts using that. G yeah. GP, trying to do the same. Get some percent with those yeah, back airs. Yeah, trying to wall out a little bit. Yeah. Got that weird miss tech launch. Oh, uh, I would have, I would have thought charge up smash. But yeah, charge up smash. Forward smash does it. Strong enough. I'll have to down smash rack some more damage. Um, scoop dish dipping way too low is Pikachu. You want to be able to sweet spot ledge all the time. There you go. Yep, there. We saw that earlier, but it was under the platform at a lower percent. This one killed. Very good awareness by JP. Can't you, you? A lot of people use that as a tech as a tech chase guess, right? For a second place to pop them up. Yes. Typically on species, though. Very good. Used for combo. JP was down, but he's. he's oh. Oh, Pikachu shenanigans. There's another one. No follow up. Missed the dash on that nair, but got the second one. JP very good with his dash dancing. Being able to keep uh, Scoop Dish at a decent. A decent distance away, yeah. so he can't get it. Well, JP was down almost the entire game, but he's brought it back. Pretty much. It's just a matter of who can see off the stock first. Yep. That's going to do it. What are we, 1-1 one, one now? Yeah, we're going to game three. Super hype, man. Super, Super hype. duper hype. Super duper hype.
more hype than a sandbagging moth than a other moth. <laughs> <laughs> I can beat Ben too. It's playing the moth did it with him is exhausting. Ben does the same thing from the ledge every time. Uh, plank ledge until you give up enough space. Or nares, from the ledge every single time. Or up airs. Some he, he always ledge hops. He always ledge hops. Always. I, you could literally dash dance grab it every time. The second you jab his shield, he freaks the fuck out. He just. So where do you think he's gonna go as a counter pick? Shake Pikachu. Ah! Uh, I want to say yeah, Fountain of Dreams. Has the platforms, but also uh, the way it's set, she can uh, capitalize a lot better because of the platform. Right? I'm trying to think of a better stage here. I, I, I'm trying to think the advantages of Sheik Pikachu. Probably the the small horizontal stage uh, gives Sheik a lot better um, kill options. But JP has been getting a lot of money off of these vertical kill options, so he just kind of take a, he just kind of took away like yeah a lot because of the higher ceiling. Yeah. Pretty much, he got up smash kills and up air kills on Yoshi's story. Now we can't do that. Now he has to rely on fair kills and nair kills and bear kills and yeah, all that shit. Yeah, he has been showing a very, um, a tendency yeah. to do that. But, oh, doesn't it doesn't matter. Yeah, what looks like poor DI from Scoop Dish is going to be a kill at 95%. Hey man, it doesn't matter how, how, how high the ceiling is. If you DI up, you're going to die much quicker. So uh, that's a lead from JP. Scoop Dish trying to battle back into this. See, Scoop Dish is up smash so strong is that um that the um that's another thing I don't get is that in Fountain of Dreams since it's wider vertically and smaller horizontally, Scoop Dish has been getting kills off of F smash. He hasn't been using up smash to get kills. He used up smash to thunder once. Yeah, wasn't that just on Yoshi's right? Yeah, you advanced at 120 percent. He essentially nerfed an option which wasn't being used against him. And here we are on Fountain where it doesn't matter anyway because it was at 152% and finally did his textbook edge guard. That's the one downside she really oh, is her gosh. up beyond stage. Oh, wait, yeah. right there. That's the game. Get her off stage, hold ledge. Uh, when the poof happens, do a regular get up and then just react. Mm -hmm. So he's trying to nair, nair Pikachu out right now. Yeah. Oh, nice down smash. It just seems like a lot of Pikachu's aerials just aren't as good as Sheik's. And that's that's what uh, that's what JP is using a lot it's to true. capitalize. Uh, Pikachu Cap and Rez Up Air doesn't uh, like Pikachu has a hard time against floaties. Up Air doesn't combo like it does against heavies. Um, Nair is decent. Back air is too laggy. And then he can't tail spike really like he can against uh yeah. followers. It's like the only aerials you can use in neutral or like neutral air and up air. Yeah. yeah. And then up air doesn't really get you mileage as it, as it would in other matches. Yeah, if this was Spacey's or Falcon, then Pikachu's up air would be not only good for comboing, but beautiful, beautiful gimping. Nice fair. Picks up the stock. Yeah. It took a while, though. Yeah, that was 179%. That's not the kind of stock that you want. I would take 179% stock any day. Because he put him on 91% during this. Yeah, that's what I call extra credit. There's the points, like, when you see some kind of suicide edge guards and stuff like that, you always got to take a look at your percent if it's worth going for it, like, this hard. If you have, you know, a stock lead or, you know, you're up there with stocks and you really feel like you can nail this and take one of their early stocks and get a good trade, if you have 150, 160%, that's super good. That's an amazing trade. Because your stock is used up, you're pretty much screwed. Yeah, any strong hit at that point will kill you. And even a light hit might lead to an edge guard. Yep. Uh, JP holding firm on this lead, though. Good, uh, good 80 plus lead now. Ooh, Phantom up smash. Phantom up smash. That was a Phantom? Yeah, there was no weak hit on that. Soft hit back here. A strong hit will kill. Forward smash. Yeah, odd forward smash. I, I always want to say those are tech errors, but I have a feeling. Know. Yeah, I feel know. like that one wasn't. It kind of it kind of covered. It looked intentional. I don't know what else it would do. Maybe you know, short hop bear or something like that. Yeah. Uh, Scoop Dish really wants to put on this pressure if he wants to win this, yeah. but. He needs to get a really nice combo. Ooh, good thunder. Um, it was at very low percent now. Which yeah, it doesn't do much, but hey, you get percent, another up smash, decent DI, enough to live. Yeah, and he's back on. Yep. 
Mayor Shield, my bad. Yeah, JP just playing patient, waiting for a scoop dish to make that unsafe move and just punishing for it. I'll be at the punishes uh, are light. Well, he gets oh. up smash anyway. So can scoop dish do the 62% down on Fountain of Dreams? I think he can do it if he plays. If he plays his game. If he doesn't fall for anything that JP's trying yeah, to do. Yeah, but if he's if he keeps letting JP dictate this pace, it's over. <laughs> This oh. could be turns of Jordan. Oh, oh. you don't want to see that. Cock block! Xanthan! Road jump up! Scream! Super cock block. I'm going to go play. I'm going to keep my hands warm. Uh, well, no, 